What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Disney Planes unboxing. Today, I'm going to be unboxing Zed Custoid. And if you know me and you've been on the channel for a good long time, I've mentioned Zed Custoid a good amount of times saying that I've wanted him and I'm hoping to get him for Christmas. But he finally got, I finally got him. Um, if you haven't saw, if, if you had, if you don't follow me on, um, Google Plus, um, or Instagram, I, I posted a picture of him, most, a good amount of you guys saw it, um, and in the post, I mentioned that my dad's friend got it for me, which I was very thankful for, because, like, it, it's a pretty real guy. I posted it on Google Plus, on Disney Docket, replied, seeing, like, on the lines of, um, this is a very, one of the best characters released from Disney Planes, I was, I show you the comment that he posted on the screen but I do agree with him this was this is an amazing character in my opinion that the Disney planes has um released given us um one of my favorites another one I am planning to get and hoping to get in the future is a planes named Sharps I believe he's also a great planes character but so far, Zeka Sword is a little, a lot better than Sharps, but I will have to see Sharps to determine which is better. But so far, we got Zeka Sword. So let's get into a review of the packaging. And so we got Zeka Sword here. We got his art, amazing. Um, we got Disney Plains, and we got Chops Knight. And his, I'll mention his appearance in the Chops film, short film later for the description of the series it reads dusty and the piston peak friends gather in the hangar for a top secret viewing of chops a tv show that blade ranger used to star in and here's some other characters released in the series your generic um i forget the the squad name but these are the characters pinecone i know was also a rare one but zeka sword was a lot harder to find and you see right here that's the date it was released 2015 it says 2014 but that's the year they um planned the release date of it so i believe this guy was released of 2015 of the summer you can correct me on that and you can correct me on the date of his release but I believe it was 2015 of the summer or around Christmas of 2014. But anyways, without further ado, I'll be back with this absolutely amazing die cast out of the packaging. Here is Zed Custard out of the packaging and I have to say he looks absolutely phenomenal. And so now, before we get into review of this character, I'd like to show you the, the scene where he was found in. Um, not lots of people um, aren't really sure where he is in the film but I believe I have found him he is in the beginning of the film when they're going through the highway or the beltway whatever you call it um, but he's in that beginning scene he's only on screen for about at least a second and a half to two seconds very short screen time for this very amazing die cast but that is that in my opinion that is him on the screen in the show and yeah I believe I believe that's all I had to say before we get into a view with them so now let's get into a view with them <laughs> so right away you can see he has a generic um, expression he's smoking he seems to be happy to be deliver to be delivering these donuts um, good detail on the headlights the mirrors are plastic, they're very big. <laughs> My favorite part about them is the design of the of the donuts. They're called Win Winchos Donuts. And I like that the N is a um toe hitch. And the donuts look like a lug nut. If you don't know what lugs lug nuts are, they are part of a um they are basically kinda like um screw caps that they put on. The base is those little dots right there that keep the um, hubcap and the wheel onto like the axle of the car. Next, next detail of the bolts going around the body. 
here's the back I'm kind of disappointed that they don't didn't give him a license plate but you know he's still okay with that one on this side same details you can see that the stepping stool thing here they detailed that in silver that's very cool nice of them and here's the base yeah I had it correct the first time um, nothing much this says made in China um, Mattel and then these two if you see right there not much good lighting but there's a screw there and a screw there I believe these two are rivets that hold in the cab but the back hole is held in by screws that's usually how Mattel does it with their cars they hold it in with screws and all that but anyways, that, I believe that's mostly it of today's unboxing video. Sorry it was so short of such an amazing guy, in my opinion. But I don't think there's much cars I can compare them to. Um, there's um, Dustin Meadows, I believe, and Miles, who are two other delivery trucks released in Cars 1. But I sadly do not have those. But when I do I will compare them to them because those are like 1960s delivery trucks and this is more like a um the year this guy this model was based off of um 2000 um I'm gonna say Foy he kinda looks like um, a GMC delivery truck in my opinion if you see those on the road you don't really see those that much anymore but he kind of resembles a GMC delivery truck, in my opinion. But anyways, guys, that's basically it for today's video. Uh, I'm sorry I haven't been able to get much unboxing videos out. My last unboxing video was released a month ago, and that was opening up Fabulous Hudson Hornet Night McQueen. But I finally got another one out. So anyways, thank you so much for watching this video, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.